mixed reactions as Paul Okoye wishes his girlfriend a former IV a happy birthday on his verified Instagram page. So today, a former IV who is Paul Okoye's new girlfriend celebrates his 23rd year's birthday. And guys, it was massive. He she posted this beautiful picture you are seeing right now on your screen. And her lover reposted it on his page. That is Paul Okoye of p -Squid. This got lots of people talking. There were lots of positive and negative comments on the post. One thing with this life is that whatever you do, people must surely talk. If you do the right thing, they must talk. If you do the wrong thing, they must talk. The best is just to do you and everyone will adjust. Not just that, stream billet also hits Yon Idoshi, who is also a polygamist like he calls himself. Stream bullets still hits her on top this matter. But before I get right into this video, if you haven't yet followed my page, I don't know what you are waiting for. Please click on the follow button to join this amazing community and do not forget to subscribe to my channel if you are watching on YouTube. So without further ado, let's just get right into this video. So my people, I told you guys that Pon Okoye's girlfriend celebrated her 23rd year's birthday today. And Pon made this post on his verified Instagram page for his lover. He wrote, Happy sweetest birthday, my love, with lots of love emojis, okay? I love you at Ivy Zini. And she replied, I love you so much, my baby. Thank you. Okay, so this post got lots of people talking. Someone else commented and said, Nothing much difference between this man and the young. But what differs is that he's good in selecting a fresh turkey, not like your that shows to be with a mama. Anyways, happy birthday, Ivy. So a lot of people said different things after he posted this picture. Some people emphasized on his wife, his ex-wife. Some of them said that Paul Okoye never celebrated his ex-wife like this. When he was with his ex-wife, that is Anita, that he doesn't write this kind of love emoji. Like, you see how he wrote plenty love emoji for this lady, that he never used it for his ex-wife when they were to get a kid. So, so this got people talking. A lot of people emphasized on this. And the way he celebrated this one, he made a lot of posts on Twitter, on Thread, on Instagram, like everywhere. He made so many posts that this lady, that's the girlfriend, had to repost and say, tell this man I love him too. Like the post was just too much for the girl because he posted everywhere. Like he posted her on Thread, on Twitter, on Instagram, like everywhere. Or like when his wife was with him there was no much celebration or some of them even said that the highest place he posted his wife when she was with him was on his instagram story that he would just write all saying happy birthday and that's all so so this got people talking and that's of your edoshi that one of the commenters wrote the person said that your edoshi doesn't select good women some of the comments I saw here read, Happy birthday, beautiful. I'm glad you are here standing strong. So much better than you were. You ignored the noise and continued to be you. Shares to a golden era. People should understand that. No longer with Anita. He said it publicly that he's no longer married to Anita. So he's free to move on. He's free to ill marry anyone he wants to unlike your edoshi that went and cheated on his wife i know that Paul might have cheated but at least he respected his ex-wife by not impregnating another woman before they divorced okay but this guy here i think he has officially divorced his wife and they're no longer together that is what i want people to understand he is free to choose someone else like Anytime that he posts the picture of his of this his new girlfriend, people just keep complaining in love and it's not making sense. He's free to move on. Like I also heard that my wife has already 
you know, there was even a time they said that his ex-wife was even engaged to another man. But I don't know how true this is, okay? Is this, this comment that this person dropped and said that there is no much difference between this man and y'all. Honestly, there are difference between y'all, Edoshe, and this man. Okay, like I said earlier, the, um, Paul is divorced, but Yo did not divorce his wife before impregnating Judy Austin. Had it been Yo, Edoshi divorced his wife before impregnating Judy Austin, it would, it would have been a different ball game. Nobody will, you know, we drag him or anything. He did not divorce his wife. He just went ahead and started dating another woman, seeing this, um, seeing Judy Austin, and even went to the extent of impregnating Judy Austin. But this man, respected his wife he did not impregnate anyone he just that thing did not work out the way it's supposed to be and they broke up okay they divorced and everyone went their separate ways and i'm sure he's happy with this lady as you can see anytime you see him they're always showing up their love life living so well and you know all of that enjoying themselves okay that's the most important thing once they are happy i don't see anything bad in this okay and again his ex-wife moved on with someone else who knows so let's not criticize them and be happy for them and the girl is literally happy with her new man paul pekoi you can see with him on where her face even when people drag her uh, paul okay is much older than her she did not just keep all she wants is just to be happy and the both of them are happy so i celebrate her and i celebrate the both of them and all so guys what do you all think about this let me know in the comment section below okay i'm going to stop here for now do not forget to like share subscribe and i'll see you guys in my next video bye